Rams. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action here in this game two. And on the fourth for Detroit here in the fourth. We've got Bird. Jackson is out there with Bryant. Then there's Chamberlain, and it's Drummond in at the five. Now here's Jackson. Chamberlain a screen. Jackson kicks to Drummond. Four on the shot clock. Stolen by Thompson. Bird against James. And he banks in the lane. LeBron's got the first field goal of the fourth quarter here for the Cavs. And what's your take, guys, on the hustle sticks for the Cavaliers? The activity level defensively, I I've really been impressed with. They've been in attack mode on the defensive end. They haven't wasted time getting the ball up the court tonight either, and it's resulted in a lot of fast break points. Here's Isley, guarded by Jackson. Isley, the best still alive. Off target from outside. Boy, that's a surprising miss right there. He usually feasts on those wide open opportunities. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. The free throw drops for Bryant. Well, just take a look at what Kobe's done tonight. He's got eight points, and he's getting it done on the glass, too. You're right, Clark. He's done some real nice work on the inside. Here's what Detroit's going with right now. O'Neal comes in for Trump. And Lorenzo Brown subbed in for Jackson. Here's Thompson. And lots of contact there. Missing the shot. He'll shoot two. Will Chamberlain picks one up. And as usual, he's the one directing traffic out there, guys. Hey, hey guys, he always has such a firm grasp of exactly what the game plan is. He's always talking, making sure that all five guys are on the same page. Kyrie Irving's checked in for the Cavaliers. Johnson, he's checked in for Detroit. Contavious called Will Pope comes in for Kobe. The shot's good by Chamberlain. And this has been purely a display of offense that we're seeing here today. And you know, it's only getting better as both of these teams' defenses are starting to show signs of wearing down. I tell you what, you don't want to allow too many of those kinds of baskets with the game on the line. This is when the defenders really have to protect the basket. You need to be in sync as a unit defensively. Check the screen on Irving. And here's Brown outside. Rebounded by Land. Land's got his third rebound on the night. And it's blocked. The 17th foot. Good off the back rim and in. Caldwell Pope's got the lead up to four now for Detroit. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for Detroit. Contested shots and block shots. They're bread and butter defensively. They're giving up no easy looks. Yeah, but also, they haven't missed a beat in terms of their fast break game. That's been equally as effective all night long. And I like how he puts himself in position there to finish on the break. Yeah, you know, that's what we call seeing and feeling the game. Excellent read of how that play was going to develop and where the ball was going. That's stuff that you oftentimes can't teach, Greg. Timeout called the Cavaliers. Yeah, too many easy buckets coming from inside, and I think he wants to make that a point of emphasis. I would certainly think so. I mean, if they keep giving up those kinds of easy looks inside, They'll be in big trouble. And now Doris Burke has an update from the sidelines. Thank you, Kevin. I got a chance to hear what the Cavaliers head coach was saying to his team. He let his players know that they've got to do a better job on defense. He said, they're scoring any way they want. We've got to show some pride here. Let's make a stand defensively, get a stop, and get on a run of our own. Do they have it in them, Kevin? That's leadership. Really, really valuable to have someone who can just take charge like he has. Well, there's a certain amount of confidence you have when the ball is in his hands at that end of the floor right now. I mean, he just gives you a sense of calm and confidence because of how good he is. Detroit leading by four. By no shot. And the shot is good, dropping in off the front of the rim. And that's 19 points for Michael Jordan. Cavaliers have gone 4-7 from the field since the beginning of the fourth. James with it, guarded now by Larry Bird. No good from Lamb. And that's not the best of shot selection there. The defense definitely won that possession. Yeah, I think in that case, you've got to go elsewhere with the ball. You just can't rise up over the top of him when he's on you. I mean, that's a tough break for the D. I mean, he took the hit 
and drew the whistle. Yeah, but he was late to get there, Greg, so the referee couldn't give him a free pass on that one. Shoots. And it's Bird missing. The Cavaliers trail by six. James left side. Fires from 18. Again, the Cavaliers score. Key buckets, and we know he delivers down the stretch. Now a timeout called by Detroit. And you can tell they're just a little out of sync. I think he just wants to get everybody back on the same page. Yeah, I like this timeout, Greg. I think it's a good one because it looks like they need a, a minute to talk things through here. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. Good game for Irving. 12 points and 9 assists. This is some performance we're witnessing out of him. My man, a night to remember. No doubt about it. He's off on the second. It just hasn't been a very good day for him, guys. They need him to start bearing some of those. LeBron outside. The drive by Love. Yes, that's LeBron picking up the assist. James has got six assists here tonight. And that they need for those points. And I bet he's the guy that continues to go for it. Well, unless they alter the defense on him, I mean, he should be the guy they go to. This height gives them a huge edge the way they're playing in there. So keep going to it until the defense adjusts. Boy, right down to the wire here, Clark. Still anyone's ball game. Both teams really invested now. I mean, this is the type of game you love to win and you hate to lose. Yeah, and after all the energy both sides have expended, both teams still hungry for the win. So it's Detroit now. Ryan against Love. Just five to shoot. Shoots from 14. And the dunk by O'Neal. And gobbled up that rebound and went straight into attack mode on the putback. Oof, he, he is one of the most determined rebounders, Clark, we have got in the NBA. Yeah, you're calling it right, Kevin. I mean, he gets so many second chance points because of how hard he works to get to the rebound. And the Cavaliers call time here. They're trailing by one. 112 left in the game. Chance 
here is to lob it towards the basket and go for the tipping. There's not enough time left to catch it. 